we will discuss about the differences between ram and rom ram ram is an acronym of random access memory and rom is an acronym of read only memory ram is a volatile memory and rom is a non volatile memory what is a volatile memory and what is a non volatile memory uh, volatile memory is such type of memory which maintains its data while the device is power on and when power is interrupted it's lost the data but uh, in non volatile memory it does not lose the data or content when power is lost so we can see in non volatile memory that it can hold the saved data even if the power is turned off so ram ram requires flop electricity to retain data and rom does not require the flop electricity to retain data ram stores information temporary and rom stores information permanently ram has larger size with higher capacity and rom has small size with less capacity ram is used for reading operation as well as writing operation and rom only used for reading operation what is reading operation and what is writing operation reading operation is such type of operation in memory which reads the previously stored data and writing operation means to store a new data in memory so ram can read the previously stored data as well as it can store the new data in the memory but in rom it only read the previously stored data uh ram is costlier since it has larger size it needs more power and uh, it has higher capacity uh ram is costlier so but in uh, rom rom is smaller size and uh, so it's uh, cheaper than ram ram is very fast rom is not much faster fast as uh, ram but it is also fast ram uses a lot of power but rom uses a little power ram is uh, used in cpu cache primary memory rom is used in firmware microcontrollers and uh, here we see the real life pictures of ram and rom if you want to write the definition or uh, meaning of volatile memory that you will write from here what is volatile memory and uh, also if you want to write for non volatile memory you can write from here what is non volatile memory and uh, to understand what is the meaning of reading and writing you will also write the meaning of read operation and write operation okay thank you see you in next topic